What's up everybody? So today I thought it would be fun to do a clean with me video where I just clean my house, different little areas that need to be cleaned. Um, I'm not cleaning like my whole entire house, but there are many areas hints right here then they'd be clean and straight and you guys have my organization videos and my cleaning videos so i thought that this would be a really cute video to do it's kind of a gloomy day it's actually kind of chilly outside and i'm just in a hoodie and sweats and i just it's a great day to do some stuff around the house so i thought i would film it and take you guys with me on this cleaning journey this little cleaning journey maybe it will inspire you to clean or maybe you will just enjoy the show and relax so, with that being said, let's jump right in. Be sure and subscribe to my channel before you leave. Give this video a thumbs up. Let's do it together and let's go ahead and get started. Peach, come on, let's go clean. She's like, come on. Also up here, I got this new lamp from Anthropology. I just put it here. I'm kind of liking it. I love the rustic vibe that it is. And I just put it on some coffee table books. I always get questions about my coffee table books and they're from Amazon. Almost all of them are. You can get any coffee table book off Amazon. Okay, my bedroom on the other hand is more of a wreck. These are all clean clothes I'm about to fold. And then my closet, I just have to put away a bunch of stuff and I may refold and organize some of the drawers in here. So we're gonna do this today. This is Peach's clothes basket. Angel, hi darling. Um, so this is a clothes basket from H&M and she fell in love with it. She sleeps on top of it. She sometimes goes inside of it. It's like that kitty cat material. They love to claw. Don't you, don't you bad girl. So um, whenever she got sprayed by the skunk, I don't know if you follow me on IG, but that was a total fiasco. Um, she ran into her safe place, her basket. So the basket stank. It smelled like skunk. So we had to throw it in the trash and I literally, I ordered her another one. They're from H&M, H&M Home. They love the balcony life. See you later, alligators. I'll probably open this door to let some fresh air in. Bam. Angels. Little angel. You love your baby. Yeah. I have these uh, blankets out here as their cat beds. They love to sleep on them, take naps on them. Yeah. Is it yours? Oh, sweet girl. Okay guys, first thing I'm going to do is make my bed. I make my bed every single day, and that's probably odd, but I like getting into a made-up bed. But throughout all of my 20s, I don't think I ever made my bed, like once, like ever. I would like have dirty clothes in my bed and just go to sleep in the pile of dirty clothes. Like I did not care. Now I'm just like, I actually like making up my bed. Okay guys, now I'm going to fold all of the clothes, the clothes that hang up up here. This is my clean laundry. I just literally throw it in the floor of my bedroom. <laughs> I try to throw it in the floor of my bedroom, so it's like a constant reminder that I need to put it away. <sighs> but I hate doing it guys. I hate folding clothes. But then once I get going, I'm like, okay, this is good, you know. This is good stuff to do. You 
You guys, if you haven't seen Nicole Concilio's new merch, I just washed this shirt so I could wear it, but so cute. All her shirts like sold out so fast, but they're like the cutest design, so I expect nothing less. I also wash all of our reusable face masks. This is your friendly reminder to wash your face mask to avoid breakouts. I just bought this new bra from Skims. I found it at Nordstrom's. What do you guys think? I love little bras like this to wear around the house. They're my favorite. Okay, I just want you guys to know it's like 8 a.m. on a Sunday morning and I should be asleep in my bed right now, but I'm cleaning. <laughs> oh, you can't see. <laughs> so we're gonna put away some of this. Why is the camera so crooked? What? Look at these bags. These bags say you should be asleep. Okay, we're gonna put away this stuff and then I might organize a few of my drawers. Also, since I made the intro, like a day's pass, I got my nails done. Super cute. Y2K vibes, kind of. And I went with blue because I always do something a little more neutral. However, my last pair was all pastels. Okay, so this drawer, which I'll show you, I actually keep pretty organized. So I keep my more bandeaus right here. I keep my sports bras here. Oh, sorry, these are bandeaus. These are like dressy bras. These are ones I wear around the house. These are sports bras. So I have four categories in here and I just try to keep them kind of organized. But yeah, over here. So I'm just gonna put away, like this is not a sports bra to me. It's just too loose fit, which I love it. This thing's so old, but it's really comfy. So I just fold these in half and I put them over here. So everything is just so easy to find this way. And then anything that fits more like a sports bra is a little tighter. I put on this side. Since I have been working out like four days out of the week, at least four days out of the week, I need my sports bras so often, so I try to organize them. These are my favorite bras from Skims. They're like so stretchy and comfy. I have a ton of them, and they don't go in the sports bra section. I recently bought this from Skims, this, this uh, line. However, the underwear in this line is so uncomfortable. I bought a size small and it literally was cutting into my legs. It hurts so bad to wear. So I guess I'm just gonna have to get rid of those. But honestly, that was the first Skims item I've ever bought that literally I hate it. So that sucks. But my bras are put away and this drawer always looks pretty organized. I try to keep it that way. This is stuff I need to hang. A lot of these are Tylers. So I'm gonna put them over here. Hanging up tie shirts. I try to get tie to do my because oh. I try to get Ty to do most of his laundry himself because honestly, growing up, his mom did all his laundry, like all of it. And in college, I would come every other weekend and do a lot of his laundry. And then I realized, why has this man never done his own laundry? Like, absolutely not. So honestly, we have different clothes baskets and I put my laundry in a clothes basket, he puts his. That's just my rule. I'm just like, there's, you should not live your life never having doing laundry. And if I ever have a son, He's gonna do his own laundry. This shirt smells so bad, he just bought it. It smells like ass. So I'm gonna have to wash it. I try to wash anything we get that's brand new. Stinks, you guys. You guys, I bought myself a bikini for Cabo. Me and Ty are going to Cabo. I'm so bummed because Manny and Daniel had planned a Cabo trip. They're going, I think, this week? Yeah, they're going this week. And I'm like, can't go because me and Ty are going on our anniversary trip to Cabo the next week. So I can't spend two weeks in Cabo. I have too much to do. So it's just like, ugh. So I told them I couldn't go. And then I told them that whenever they go, I'm gonna tweet and tell everybody I wasn't invited. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I was being shady. Cause I'm like, we'll have FOMO, but I'm the one who said I couldn't go. So, Manny's like, you're a dick. But, I can't do 
guys, I can't do two weeks there. Plus I'll be like so ready to come home. So I'm missing out on one of my trips. And I bought this swimsuit from Good American to wear and I put it on, it's pretty cute on. Fits me pretty well. Looks like this. And then this is the top. Really simple. And then I bought from Good American this skirt. I'm gonna detag it because I already tried everything on. I bought this little wrap around skirt. I thought it'd be cute with a swimsuit. So I'm just gonna put this one in my swimsuit. Now I wanna tackle my t-shirt drawer with you guys because, oh my gosh, I have so many t-shirts. <sighs> this drawer used to be so, I can't even get it open all the way. This drawer used to be so organized and now it's not. So I was gonna try to work on this a little this morning with you guys. Okay, here we have the t-shirt drawer. I just folded all of these so. They won't even fit in here at this point, so I need to get rid of some shirts. So here we go. This is Manny merch. I'm sorry I keep sniffling. I have allergies. Any of my band tees, I'm definitely keeping. They just need to be refolded. This is my only Alabama tee, and I definitely need to get more. I'm a huge Alabama fan. This one I think has a hole in the armpit. Where's the hole? Oh my God. Someone, I need a new shirt. Marie Kondo. That's how I like to fold my shirts because truly that is the way you can fit the most of them in your drawer. So this is how she does it. And it's really a quick way to fold them. Da da da, da da da. And then they sit kind of like this in the drawer. That, so we're gonna fix this drawer. It used to be that way, but I still fold them the same way. As you can see, I have a lot of White Fox Boutique tees they sent to me, very sweet of them. These are long sleeve tees. This one's from White Fox too. I need a refold and another White Fox tee. Actually their t-shirts are so comfortable guys. They're like really big and thick too. This is my old Lardley Los Angeles t-shirt. I, oh, I love this old faded dirty shirt. <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of this tie dye tee. It's cute, but I don't need it. I'm gonna get rid of this tee. Just never wear it. This is a vintage tee, I would say, from Tyler's College Town in Auburn. It's called Niffers. Yeah, I just keep it as a keepsake. I try not to wear it. And I found it in Aaron's room and I was like, what are you doing with that shirt? Oh my gosh, another band tee. This one is not folded correctly. Let's fold it so it will fit in our drawer. Okay, I have to get rid of things and I'm struggling. This is Nicole's other merch. I'm gonna get rid of this little Nike crop because I literally never wear it. Another band tee, Van Halen. I'm, this Zara shirt is cute, but it's like so tight. I never wear it, it's like tiny. So I'm like, get out of here. This Nike shirt, I literally never wear. This shirt from Brandy, like if I lift my arms up, everything comes out, so I'm gonna get rid of it. This is a plain black shirt. I'm definitely gonna keep, it's not that tight fitted. I'm gonna get rid of this shirt because it has stain on it. I'm gonna let this one go. It was so cute for while it lasted. This is some of Katie's merch. And then I also have her 30 years brand. I really love this color green. It's like one of my favorites. So this is really cute. This is one of my favorite like oversized shirts. Like it's long sleeve and I wear it truly all the time. These are all like not comfortable t-shirts. These are all like more like dress shirts, but they're still t-shirts. Okay, here's the satisfying part where I get to put everything in. You do wanna press stuff down though, so that way it, the drawer will close. Make sure you give everything enough space, so that way. Ta-da! We have more t-shirts. Here are my long sleeve tees. I feel like I'm gonna leave them like that because I have all these band tees that need to go in. There we go. And then these are my long sleeves. So there we have it. You guys, that looks so much better. We have band tees, long sleeve tees, just random tees, random tees to wear. And the drawer closes. And this is what we got rid of. Okay, the last drawer we're gonna tackle before we jump into the beauty room is my bra drawer. Yeah, okay, this is what it looks like. It's supposed to look a lot better than this, but it doesn't. I have so many of these strapless bras from Victoria's Secret. I always get asked what strapless bra I wear. And yeah, this is it. It says it is the very sexy multi-way purpose, multi-position, multi-way, multi-position bra. I've had these for years though, look. Three of them. I might even have more. I think I have, look, four. This is another one, I have four of them. They give me a little bit of a lift. This bra I really love from Harper Wild. 
It's one of my faves, really comfy. There's like barely any padding in it, so thin. I just got this one from Skims, and I don't know how I love how it makes my boobs look, because it's just like literally stretchy cloth and wire. Oh look, I have two black ones. This is one of those sticky bras. I think I'm gonna let this go because I think it's ruined. This is such an old bra, it's like torn from Victoria's Secret, but I like it still, so. I have my bra accessories in this first part here and there's a little divider in here here's some spanx i'm gonna get rid of this guy it is way too padded for me it looks like i have double d's and i don't i only have a c cup so it's like unnecessary for me i'm also gonna get rid of this bra because it's like a tea bag from victoria's secret and i never wear it um i'll keep this boob thing this is nipple covers. Actually, I'll keep this one and get rid of this black bra from Victoria's Secret. It's too big for me. These are my dividers from Amazon. And what I'm gonna do, all these strapless bras in the back. Like that. Then I'm gonna put all my strap bras in here. How cute is that? And then I have this flimsy one from Kent Skims I'll put up front so I remember to use it. Okay, this drawer looks about a million times better and now I can just go through and pick whichever bra I need and then we have our accessories. Okay guys, the closet is clean! Maybe we'll organize some of the other drawers in another video, but let's move down to the beauty room. Okay guys, so <laughs> I like how the hair is just like shooting out. I have this container with my <laughs> extensions. This is a wig. And I need you to move it. I need you to move it, please. Okay, guys, I have this fabulous Saint Laurent box. And guess what's inside? Hair. Lots. Like, what do, What have I ever planned to do with this? Let me show you how good I look. Honestly, it could work. Okay, for starters, I want to get this and this out of here because you barely have leg space when you sit down the toilet because of all my extensions. I don't know why they're here. I'm gonna get Ty to help me. I need you to move something for me. I can move it, but I don't want to. What? So I wanna move this and this into the closet. I made a spot for it. Both of these? Yeah. What are you doing? Hi. Of the box? Saint Laurent. Ain't no purse in it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is where things are gonna get hairy. Okay. Get it? Hairy? <laughs> Because they're right. <laughs> okay, so I have this spot that I created right here. Let's unplug the HDMI so we don't rip that down. Stack it. So then I think maybe the Eve Saint Laurent box on top of that. It'll go over there. What's in here? More wigs? Yeah. <laughs> you know I wear Where wigs. Where do you keep your wigs? Oh, I buy Eve Saint Laurent box. I let it go. Let it go. Oh. That's great. Look, I'll put away. And put this one on. Manny is going... Put this one on. Okay. Manny is going to faint when he goes to take his poop at in our bathroom. And it's going to be an actual bathroom? Yeah. Woo! I'm ready. <laughs> Honestly, you, ready? you look very Matthew McConaughey, yeah. surfer movie. All right, all right, all right. Uncanny, no difference. Uncanny. You should look at yourself. This is what cleaning is to us. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much on this side. It's so lovely. Yes, here. Matthew. All right. You look sick, bro. What are we doing now? Right on. I'll, Babe, I'll I need it. you to paint this wall. Gotta keep We down. hung a yeah, frame yeah. on this wall and like the paint melted onto the wall or other we have black Man. mold and we're gonna die. No, no, it's not black mold. It's the backing of that. Yeah, it was like cheap. Poster like board. Poster board was. thing and it like melted onto our wall. So, so that's exciting. These are the old blue colors though. So are we not gonna I kept this, this room blue white? because it kind of like gives it a cool tone, but I do want to paint it white now. Yeah, I say we just, why just paint this wall? We can paint them all. Okay, I'm supposed to be cleaning right now. What are you doing? Bad. <laughs> um, okay, right. this closet, come help. I think since you're here, I mean, might as well. Might as well. You're literally fixing your wig, asking me if I need your muscle. Am I the muscle in this yeah. scenario? You guys, look at this. <gasps> first things first. This is just a catastrophe. I need you to come in here. Okay. <laughs> and I need you to help. Why are you laughing? What's so funny? I don't understand. This f***ing bob on you, I'm okay. dead. 
How did this video turn into me cleaning out your bathroom? <laughs> uh, there seemed to have been some swindling that went on here. I'm good at it. Babe, some of it, I don't even know what's in these bins. Probably spiders. I know, right? I've seen spiders in here before. There's literally a vase in here. <laughs> There's no spiders. Like, what is this? You just order random sh and just throw it in your shower. What is this? I didn't know it was this bad, guys. How do you deal with this? I don't. This has gotten bad. <laughs> I feel partly responsible for not checking in on you here. I like, is all this gonna be one video when you open? No, I don't even know why it's in like, here. Like, title it, opening the random sh in my shower that I ordered. This is what quarantine did to me. Is it? No, this I've been doing this for years. <laughs> Tyler finally took the wig off. He couldn't stand it anymore. Yes. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> so now we are just, as in he, is removing the trash from the shower. Wait, what is this? Oh my God. Are they all just like gadgets? What are they? I'm not sure. I have to go through every box, guys. Uh -huh. A lot of this stuff could be from Wish. I ordered for videos in the future that I never got around to and now I just have like tons of dollar, three dollar, like travel size shampoos. This is not even half of it, guys. Like unopened packages. What is this? It's like he wants to hurt me. Babe, there's something for the kitchen in here. There's something, there's something for everyone in here. I found it. That light you put in there, I just wanted to tell you. Oh, the one thing I put in here. I just wanted to tell you, this is our mess. What? I don't know. I think that was Wish swimsuits I was gonna try on and I never did. This was probably like a Christmas this, present you were no. supposed to give me. No, I was gonna tie-dye shirts, but I never got around to it, and uh -huh. shorts. Organization. It looks so pretty in here now. Oh god. Freaking quarters anonymous. Okay, first of all, look at this gorgeous stoned shower that we never use. Fabulous. Wow, look all the holes having to just unclog. Work their way. Okay, shower check. All clear. Are you ready to review? This is what we, Ty has what literally been out. opening all these bags for me. I'm interested to know what you've got just like sitting over here. This looks like a neat little thing. What is what this? What is this, Laura? Floating this... and rotating. Oh, it's a globe. Yeah, that's like a desk thing. Ace. I think I was gonna try all this stuff out for Wish and I never got around to it. Look, this is like wall towel. It looks like sh cat toy. They I think like you were this. trying to do like a kitchen one related. Maybe we got some spatulas. Cause look, knives. Oh my God. I think these are just acrylic. Okay, now we're gonna tackle the desk in here. I actually went ahead and unpacked all of my makeup bags from my past few trips that I had to pack them for, for shooting photos, and went to Palm Springs so I could put all the makeup away. So let's get started. By the way, I really need to kind of go through and clean this out. So I'm gonna do that in this video. This section, I'm gonna go through and products that I'm not using on the daily. It doesn't really need to be in here and it needs to go back over here. That's gonna happen. Ooh, look at that beautiful bathroom. Still working on a lot of that, but the stuff in the bathroom we put in a donation bin. But let's go ahead and tackle the desk. Okay, so we're gonna go through and clean out these drawers. They're so packed full. They just need to be cleaned out. So it's just too much stuff. Okay, first we have have the vanity makeup sculpt set i love this cream contour so i'm keeping then i just have a hula some other stuff in here this is gonna go back this is gonna stay this i only have one pair of lashes so i'm gonna put these with my other lashes and put this back because it takes up a lot of space this is one of my favorites the hourglass vanish why do i have so many foundations in here mac I'm actually gonna put back both of these Laura Mercier bronzers and I don't mean to have two of these in here and I haven't been using this as much so I'm gonna put back. Of these two products, this is the Hourglass Powder and then this is the Chanel De Soleil uh, Cream Contour. And then this is just a product I've been wanting to try. It's the Tatcha Powder so I'm gonna keep it. Got some Patrick Ta blushes. And this one's so pretty. So, but I think I'm gonna put it back. The Laura Geller. I love this baking powder from KKW. I also have this up here. I'm gonna put that back. Guys, we're doing so good. It's just getting a little too crowded up here. One of my favorite blushes from Patrick Ta. It's 
called She's Seductive. This and this bronzer. So I'm gonna put these in here. I'm actually gonna put my two MAC, there's a hair. I'm gonna put my two MAC powders in here for setting. And I also have been enjoying this little Mario palette just for some of the neutrals in it. So now I have some space. Okay, I will say the second drawer is a little overwhelming. Like there's a red lip liner that needs to go up here. And there is a lash glue. I've been looking for my lash glues and look, here they are. And then the rest is just liners. So I'm gonna put these back where they go. And even this doesn't go in here. This can stay soft poker. Okay, this is a really good sunscreen for the face. It's almost empty though, I barely have any left. This goes in my travel kit, finishing cream. This is a priming moisturizer I'm gonna put back. Lash glue, lash glue. Okay, now I have way too many concealers in here. This goes back. This Glossier is too creasy on me. Put those down there. KVD is too heavy for every day. And I don't need two hourglass. I need this. It's a contour stick I'm gonna keep. And I think everything else, everything else can stay. That looks so much better. It's just overcrowded. Like I'm not using, these are supposed to be my everyday products, so. Girl, the mascara drawer is a joke. The brow drawer is a little messy. I really love this Charlotte Tilbury. Love the She Glam. Me and Erin use it all the time. This is one of my favorites on the rise. I'm gonna put the Huda Beauty back for now because I've used it for so long. Telescopic was okay, but not life-changing. Giga Black is life-changing for those bottom lashes. I actually like the KKW a lot, so we're gonna keep her. Lily lashes I'm gonna put in the bag. This is a terrible root pin. By the way, I'm gonna keep this one the same. These are all my lip liners pretty much, so I just keep them all up top. Alrighty, for my brow drawer, I'll keep these brow gels, but this and this are going, and this. They're all gonna go back. And then I'm gonna put this away. I get it at Target. It's good, I just don't use it every day. This is broken and it's time to retire her. And that already looks so much better, but I do need to put a couple of my brow pomades in here. I'll just set that there. That looks so much better. Actually, it needs to be clean. It's really dirty, but we'll do that last. Okay, then for up here, setting sprays, I have some Mac Fix Plus. I have the Maybelline Glass. A little bit of Patrick Ta, almost out of that. This one is also one of my favorites. These are pretty much all a little bit more dewy. I love the way it makes the makeup look. And then I have my Gucci primer, it's dirty. And then Erin loves this one from Lila B. So we put this one up here. And then I have a couple of lip products. So my lip products go in here. This needs to go back. This one needs to go back. This one from KKW just broke apart a bit. So I'm gonna get rid of it. Some of my new favorites. And then these two I'm gonna put in my purse. Hey guys, in this drawer here, it's so random. It's all hand creams and lip balm. So like facial primer, hand cream, lip balm, lip balm, shadow shield. Lip balm, lip balm. It's like lip ointments in here. I'm gonna go ahead and put my moisturizer in here too. It's like all the moisture is in here, which I love having. And I'm also gonna put my daily sunscreen lotion in here because I put lotion on a lot in here. Update, it is day three of cleaning. This should not have gone on for three days, but it did because our friends Chloe and Sebastian came over last night and I had to start preparing the food and I had to take a pause. I also bought this at Sephora, I didn't show. So I'm gonna put it in the bathroom. And then this stuff, I was trying to like organize it. Like this goes in the bathroom drawer. This does all my hair accessories. I got these at Urban Outfitters. I want to do a Y2K look. This goes upstairs with my jewelry. This goes upstairs. And then the curl cream goes upstairs. And then I have a bunch of fragrances right here I got together because they all need to go upstairs. I think I want to keep one of them down here. I think maybe Tommy Girl. Now I'm just gonna wipe down the desk. I kind of took some of the stuff off of it. Try to get some of this makeup up. And then I'm also gonna clean my mirrors. And then I just have this, wipe it down.
guys, these are the double-sided Laura Lee Los Angeles mirrors. They are officially available now. They're only 13 bucks each and they're bomb. One size, two times magnified. So if you're interested, they're at LauraLeeLosAngeles.com. I'm about to clean my mirrors because they get dirty. some more of my brushes so I just put them in this container from the container store and then also our sponge which this one's pretty dirty but this is our sponge it's only 12 bucks it's available now from at Laura Los Angeles like the desk looks so much better I have some makeup that I'm gonna have to take a stronger cleanser to get off because it does not want to lift but yeah, I think it looks so much better. I also cleaned up our boxes a little bit, straightened everything up. And then we have this, this bag is packed full. And this is stuff that I took out of the system because it was overcrowded and really annoying. So we're gonna put all this back now. This life's a drag. We're gonna put her in here. Okay, we are going to put away Ooh, our makeup. Isn't it cute how I don't know where anything goes? Like, I don't live here. Like, this isn't my <laughs> space that I put together. Where does the mascara, oh, here's mascara. Get this, can get this. My foundation drawer is getting crowded again. I'm not excited about that. Brow pomades. Second one of these blushes. This is just an eye primer. So I'm just gonna throw it back there. We have a face primer. We have Somehow this bronzer drawer has gotten too full again. All right guys, we just put away all the makeup. Clean the bathroom. I just bought this. I don't, I haven't really used it yet. Maybe I used to. Oh, look at that continuous spray. Luxury. Luxury. Okay, I think I have enough. Probably too much. It doesn't. Oh, it smells like game, guys. It smells so good. It doesn't smell like chemicals. what we did to this bathroom. It's an actual bathroom again, guys. It's echoey, it's not full. I vacuumed and cleaned really good in here. I cleaned the toilet, the sink. Oh my gosh, it looks so much better. I even went through and got rid of a couple of hair scrunchies I wasn't using and then kept my favorite ones and organized those. And then, yeah, this is what it looks like. I'm in the market for a new mirror and a funkier beauty light in here. 
And then I'll also update the hardware in here. I'll probably change that out. We already changed the handles on this to black. And this just needs a new paint job from me constantly. Um, this basket hasn't always been there, but me constantly using different bins. And then we just have some Venus Fleur flowers. They smell so good. They last like a year. Top of the toilet, a little trash can from Zara Home. And then I just have some decor from Shop Bonita. And then in the shower, it's clean, completely empty clean and empty i'm gonna put some spare shampoo and conditioner in here and body wash but it looks so good i love the marble in here i love the way it looks so let's go ahead and look at the beauty room so down here i just have a spare mirror we put up all the makeup and then i did clean up my background a little bit i'm still finagling it so i'll probably change it up a little bit i just don't have i want some more coffee table books so i gotta get some for this side but i put this faux olive tree here it's from target and this is from Crate and Barrel. I just popped it there, but I would like some books under it to give it some layering. And then I just have my extra pompous around the mirror. And yeah, I vacuumed really good. The chair is for when me and Aaron collab or we get ready together. So we have two chairs in here. And believe it or not, when you sit in these chairs and film for a long time, they hurt your butt. So I always have a blanket. And that's why I always have a blanket here too. So it's like cushion for your booty. And then lastly, we just have the desk. I already showed you. I cleaned out my brushes and what I don't use. And then I cleaned all of this out and what I'm not using. And so it's like all refreshed. I love the way it looks. I know the room isn't very cute because of all the equipment. It's just never gonna be very cute because it's a film room. It's like a workspace, but it works for what I do. I also have a blow dryer up there, okay. I'm gonna keep it there because I like to blow dry my lash curler. But yeah, I'm so happy. I'm out guys, thank you so much for watching. Be sure and subscribe to my channel before you leave and hit the like button if you enjoyed cleaning with me or if it motivated you, or maybe you just enjoyed the show. Um, but I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.